Well, I'd like to now introduce you to the INCHI, not the Da Vinci Code. I-N-C-H-I, International Chemical Identifier. And it's the greatest thing ever since sliced bread. Meet the INCHI people. Endorsed by IUPAC, who knew a good thing when they saw it. So, an INCHI describes a molecule with letters and numbers. Why is that useful? The basic idea behind the INCHI is to be able to create something uh, that will enable people to link information from a variety of sources together. So, for example, you have these islands of information and data that uh, people have created on their own uh, for individual purposes. You may very well have a scientific journal with lots of different articles about a chemical a patent database where uh, these things are patented. A large database of patient records uh, that have been given drugs. You may have some biological studies of varying kinds, toxicology and so forth, associated with the chemical. You could even have a newspaper which has been reporting on various chemicals. And each of them are independently valuable and available on their own. The problem is if you want to find a newspaper article about a particular chemical or the patents that it might be found in, uh, there's really no easy way to do it. For decades, there's been a desperate need to be able to seek out specific molecules in millions of pages of scientific literature. Capturing that knowledge, that implicit knowledge that's locked away in the literature, is, is a fantastic thing to be able to do. Fundamental to that is the representation and storage of the chemical structures. And that's really where the INCHI has helped us. So by adding an INCHI to the patents, to the biology data, to the newspapers, to the scientific journals, and so on, we're able to link all this information together. And so all one needs to do is put in this one string of information and all of a sudden you can get the information from any of these sources quickly, easily and cheaply. And it's an incredible time saver and money saver. The INCHI has been really useful in indexing up and searching the literature. But of course, once you've established the INCHI system, you can use this to organize supplier catalogs. Indexed up or organized by INCHI code or searchable by INCHI code just really transforms business. The availability of, of INCHI as open source software that we can run anywhere has been really fantastic. Open software rules modern science. The INCHI has been widely adopted. I'm absolutely astonished at how quickly the uptake has been. But one of the things that still needs to happen is smaller groups need to adopt it. People building new resources need to design INCHI in from the start. So, so come on, use it. And together we'll be able to pool our data and make a larger whole from the sum of the parts. Mm -hmm.